what is up gamers, it's your boy Dino, welcome back to a brand new tutorial here on the channel. In today's video guys, we've got another Beth modded outfit for you, for your female character. One shown on the thumbnail, obviously, because you know, we don't do any clickbait around here. So this is how to make this outfit in the uh, thumbnail, and uh, let's get straight into it. Okay, so female characters, uh, you need to go ahead and put on this sports jacket. As always, we need to start off with our merge, okay, so we've got our sports jacket. We go ahead and put our designer t-shirt on. And then we're going to go ahead and put our, our pants on as well, okay? So our pants are found on the pants section, obviously. And they are down in this category here. So this is the ones you need to put on, okay? With that, we've got the two tops on. We've got our pants on. And we need to go ahead and put some standard shoes on. So they are the sneaker shoes at the very, very bottom. Okay, so once you go ahead and done that, you can save this now as console number one outfit. And then we can move on to our merge outfit. With our merge outfit, you want to go to sm uh, Smart Jackets and put on the Navy Smart Jacket. Now you can save this now at the very, very bottom as your merge outfit. Console number two, you need to find uh, the outfit with the stickers that you want to use, or just some sort of outfit with stickers on it for the moment. And you want to go ahead and merge Console one with Console two. So if you guys don't know the glitch, I'll have a link in the description. Let's get back to it. Right, so this is what you should look like when you merge console 1 with console 2. Uh, from here we're going to go ahead and merge it into a Crooked Cop mission. So we're going to go ahead and go host up a Crooked Cop and set it to player owned clothing. Once you're right, you're going to go once to the left and once to the right. And it should merge your logos onto your outfit. With that, go into the mission, put a rebreather on and quit the mission. When you quit the mission, you're back in an online session. All you want to go ahead and do is go to the stand and save this as a new outfit called C2 Keep. This is the outfit we'll be using to merge our outfit all together at the very, very end of the tutorial. Okay, so pretty much straightforward now. All you want to go ahead and do is replace console one outfit with a new outfit as console one with the stickers on there that you want to use. So for me, you can use the blue ones, but I actually am going ahead and use the grey ones today. You got one of all these stickers you can use. Doesn't really matter which one you can use, but I'm going to go ahead and use this uh, grey one right here because I like the stickers. So what we're going to go ahead and do now is save this as your new console 1 outfit and merge it with your console 2 outfit, uh, sorry, console keep outfit, okay? So we got a console 1, and we're going to go ahead and merge it on console 2 with the C2 keep. Now we need to go ahead and make our merge uh, outfit for our merge, and we go into Crooked Cop once we transfer these over to 1. So first of all, we're going to go ahead and go to T-shirts. Now when you're in a t-shirt section, you want to scroll through here until you come across a bright yellow t-shirt, which is this one right here. Once you go ahead and put that on, all you want to go ahead and do now is go to the utility tops vests. Go ahead and put on any single one you want and then go ahead and take it off. So you should put the outcome just like this. Now if you walk around for a couple of seconds, uh, wait for a couple of seconds, your arms will reappear. Make sure you do that because, you know, you need to get our stuff back to merge it into a quick card without it glitching out. So as you see now my arms are actually all back and sorted, my neck's back, my chest is back. Walk around for a couple of seconds and then go ahead and save this as your brand new merge in your bottom slot which is top 20. Alright now we need to do the Beth glitch with console 1 and C2 keep. So go ahead and select your console 1 outfit, put the um, Israel parachute bag on, go to console 2, get your C2 keep on, get the auto save, quit the um, story mode, come back to console 1, put the parachute off. So this is what you should look like once you've gone ahead and done that glitch. You will have shoulder pads with no top underneath your smart jacket. From here, host up a crooked cop and set it to player owned clothing. Once you set it to player owned clothing, go once to the left and once to the right and it should merge all together. With that being said, go into the mission, put a rebreather on and quit the mission. Once you're back online, go ahead and save as now as your new console one outfit. Now what we'll need to do now is go ahead and make an outfit for our joggers to merge over. So all you want to go ahead and do is go to the pants section. First of all, make sure you go ahead and put a utility vest on, the sand utility vest, because we want to go ahead and put on a dope a gun belt later on in the tutorial. Then, once you've got your, your top on, go ahead and go to the pants section. This is where we need to go ahead and put on our pants to go ahead and merge it. So go ahead and follow the same components I do use here. The same as last time, our pants here, our merging pants.
you go ahead and say this now is console number one. With console number two, all you need to go ahead and do is go to the genes section and put onto the same different genes that we do easier for our merging components. So we're going to scroll through this category until you come across these genes that do go ahead and purchase here with the purple stickers on the back of it. Okay, so that is our merging pants components for our console 2 now. Now you need in your merge slot your joggers that you are going to merge. So for me I'm going to use my tan joggers. It doesn't really matter what colour you use as long as the joggers because we are flipping the colour at the very, very end. Okay, so in our console um, slot number one or two, it doesn't matter, uh, one or twenty, sorry, say sorry, you'll need to have the outfit with the joggers on. Um, so again, I'm using the tan joggers, the solo CEO save method. Uh, you can do that by doing the race and go ahead and search up on YouTube how to do it. It's pretty straightforward and pretty easy. Then come back, save those joggers in slot 20 or in slot 1, depending on which one's closest to you. And then go ahead and do the best glitch with console 1 and console 2 outfit. So I'm going to show you again what my outfits look like. Okay, so obviously I've got my joggers here. I'm going to ahead and save them now in my slot number one because I'm going to merge them on slot one because I only I need slot 20. So I'm going to call mine joggers for now. And this is what they should look like. So console one and console two. So you've got your jeans and then you've got your pants on console one. Let's do the Beth glitch and we'll come back once we've done ahead and done that. Alright, and so you should spawn back in with these pants on here. From there, go ahead and spawn on to Crooked Cop Mission and make sure it's set to player owned clothing. Once you're inside there, remember I saved mine in slot right, one. So you should so spawn back in to the right first on. and once to the left instead of once yeah, to the left and, and once to the on. right. So once to the right, come on to my left and then go ahead make and sure ready set up. to play the mission, clothing. put a rebreather or an earpiece on and quit the mission. Once you're inside there, remember I saved mine in slot one, so I'm going to go on to the right first and once to the once left to the right. Side once you quit the mission, you spawn once an online session just like this. And make sure ahead set now to and play on our clothing. shoes onto our outfit. Yeah, or an earpiece we're on and now quit. Console number once you're right, once just like so. Then we're going to head over to the shoe and section the and we're going to head over to Once you quit the mission, you spawn an online session just like this. We're going to head now and merge our shoes onto our outfit. So we're going to head now as console number one, for, um, just like taking so. Off shoes is then we're going to head over to the shoes and once to the left section, the shoes like this. then save this as console number one outfit. Then go ahead and make off another outfit with these high heel boots here. All you want to go ahead and do is select the same high heel boots I do use for our merge component. Then we go ahead and transfer these over to a console two, back over from Beth, and go ahead and merge our outfits. So these are the shoes you need to do. Now we'll save this as console number two outfit. With your best glitch, you'll need to go ahead and have a classic parachute bag to do this, otherwise the glitch will not work. So go ahead and select your console number one outfit. I uh, obviously have the outfit shoes that you want to merge in slot 20, which are my blue ones here. And then we're sorted to go. Okay, so select console one outfit. Go ahead and put your classic parachute bag on and do the best glitch. Alright, so we'll come back once we go ahead and done that glitch. Alright, so this is what you should now go ahead and look like when you spawn an online session with no shoes on. If you've got shoes on, then you have done it wrong, you need to go ahead and do it again. From here, host the Crooked Cop mission and merge your outfits together. When you're inside there, make sure it's set to player owned clothing. Go once to the left, once to the right, and it should merge all together. Go into the mission, put a rebreather on, and quit the mission. When you quit the mission, you should be back on an online session just like this with the shoes on. Go ahead and save this now as your brand new console one outfit. Now some people are having a lot of issues with this recently, the gloves merge from console to console, so from console number one you'll either have no gloves, but console number two you'll need to have the uh, grey digital tactical. Now keep in mind guys, um, it's been playing up recently for a lot of people, uh, you will not be the only person to do this, but um, best of luck I guess, okay, so you might need to do it more than once, um, more than once on this one, because you know, some people it hasn't been glitched and it hasn't been working for them, it hasn't transferred over. They've spawned in with no gloves on but I can't merge the gloves. But I've done it twice for this outfit. Uh, the first time it didn't work, the second time it actually did go ahead and work. Okay, so just a little heads up for you guys. Alright. So console one, no gloves, console two uh, are gloves, and then we had to merge it over, okay. So with this one you'll need the Israel parachute bag. 
make sure you take off your classic bag from last time go ahead and put your Israel Tarshi bag on go ahead and do the Beth glitch and obviously you'll need to have your merging uh, gloves so in slot 20 you should have your merging gloves for me I'm going to use a black one it doesn't really matter what colour you use because you're flipping it later on okay so this is what it should look like now and obviously your merge component as well so go ahead and do the Beth glitch and we'll come back once we go ahead and done that glitch Alright, so you should spawn back on after doing the breath glitch with no gloves on. Like I said before, host up the Crocker Cop mission. This is where you can find out if the glitches actually work for you or not. Make sure you set to player owned clothing. Go ahead and go once to the left and then once to the right once you're inside that mission. And this is where you figure out if it has worked or not, okay? For me, it did work the second time around. Like I said before, the first time around it did not work. All you're going to go ahead and do then is ready up once you've got the gloves on your outfit and then go ahead and go into the mission, put a rebreather or an earpiece on and quit the mission through your phone. Alright, so once you quit your mission through the phone, you'll spawn back online with the gloves on, okay? This is now near enough complete for our first outfits, okay? So all you're going to go ahead and do in a second now is put our, uh, a cop belt on or paramedic belt, whatever you're using onto our outfit okay so obviously you need the pyramid belt we've saved this now as a console one outfit and now you'll need to go ahead and merge the gas mask onto your outfit so you're going to go ahead and go to heist coveralls put on any of these with the gas masks on go to any clothing store save it as merge go to any telescope and do the telescope glitch now if you guys aren't aware how to do a telescope glitch run past the telescope spam right on your d-pad to use the telescope and it should be glitched out okay just like this you want to hold your interaction menu and select console number one outfit. When you walk away from the telescope, the glitched helmet or mask should jump onto your outfit. Now go to a clothing store or a mask store and save it as your merge console one. So I'm at the mask store, I'm going to say there's a new console one outfit. There we go, all sorted. Now you want to go ahead and take the easy way out just like you see here. Once you've taken the easy way out and you've spawned back on up, Go ahead and go up to your phone and go to Jobs Rockstar Created and go to a Titan of a Job Mission. Alright, once you're in a Titan of a Job, set all screen screens up, go to a gun store and go ahead and save this now as your brand new outfit at the very, very bottom as Merge. You'll notice the actual uh, body vest has come off. Uh, to know if the glitches worked, select a different outfit and if you can't select the Merge outfit, that means the glitches are done for you. Quit the mission, load back into an online session, then go straight to a Crooked Cop mission. When you're in a Crooked Cop, make sure it's set to player owned clothing. Go ahead and go once to the left and your gun belt or primary belt should merge onto your outfit. Go ahead and ready up, go into the mission, put a rebreather or an earpiece on and quit the mission. This is what you should be looking like just now then, okay? So this is what you should look like now. If you're merging body armor onto your outfits, go ahead and put on a uh, heavy body armor, the green one like here. Go ahead and save this now as your console number one outfit. Alright, and so I had to find a new session because people killed me. But if you want to go ahead and flip the color of your shoes, go ahead and find the components section in the description for Silent's website on how which color shoes is which. I've flipped mine now to a um, color of a gray color which just goes with my outfit so I'm gonna save this as console number one because I flipped the color okay now like I said before if you're merging armors make sure you go ahead and put on the heavy body armor just like you see save this as console one now I'll need to go ahead and put on our CEO vest with our jersey which I'm making right now so you'll need to have a CEO vest armor and you'll need to have a jersey as well okay so for me I've got the tan jersey right now uh, I'm going to have to flip the colour to white because that's what the one we are making. But if you want to, you want to go ahead and put your save your CEO armour in slot 20. Go ahead and put your jersey on and save in slot C22. So maybe you don't get mixed up with the outfits components. So I'm going to call mine C22. And with C11, you need to find the component switch to fit the colour of your outfit. Now, the jersey tops. Um, colours are, like I said, they're all linked in the description to uh, Silence website. Go ahead and check her site out itself, it's really helpful. Uh, but other than that, we need to find a component for the jerseys to flip the colour from from male. Okay, so obviously, it is in the leather jackets um, section. 
Um, doesn't matter what top you have on apart from your lung, as long as you have on the actual hoodie itself. Or leather jacket, should I say, sorry. So we're going to have to scroll through this category until we come across the red uh, like biker crop looking jacket, which I'll show you when we see it. So there's this one right here guys, the red one. With that being said, we are merging armor, so make sure you go ahead and put your armor on, your green armor, heavy heavy armor, sorry. Because we can't merge our CEO armor if you haven't got this on. So we're going to save this now as console number 1-1 one, one outfit, and we have our jersey as console number 2-2. Two, two. So, with that being said then, you want to go ahead and select your first what C-1-1 one, one outfit with the jersey, and go ahead and merge it in Beth by doing Beth glitch then merge it to Crooked Cop with your Crooked Cop mission okay alright so first of all put on a Israel Hajji bag do the Beth glitch once you've done the Beth glitch this is what you should look like when you're sporting back online white jersey okay easy flip easy done now we've got to merge it with a Crooked Cop so we're going to click start online jobs rockstar created versus Crooked Cop set it to player owned clothing go once to the left and once to the right and your CEO armor should merge through your whole jersey itself. Go into the mission, put a rebreather and quit the mission. When you're back on, save us as your brand new merge outfit in slot 20. You've got your jersey and your top done now. Pretty straightforward. Now, this is where our C2 keep comes into hand. So our C2 keep before, you want to go ahead and select that. Find the components for all the um, joggers, colors, merge, flip color and stuff like that. Okay, so first of all, you want to go to go to shorts. You want to scroll through the short section until you come across the same shorts I do go ahead and see here, which are the, like a lightish bluish color, uh, to flip it to our white joggers. Okay, so obviously you can't see a lot of the shorts here, but you want to slow down and you want to come to these shorts right here. You all see, like a creamish color, they look, they look near enough like white. So these are the ones that will flip your color to your white joggers. And uh, we're going to go ahead and go to the shoes. So obviously the shoes are always located in the rubberized boots, which are down at the bottom category, if I'm correct. Uh, you want to scroll through there. I'm pretty sure you want to find the grey ones, okay? So again, we're going to look at them on Silence website for the shoes flip colour. So we don't want to go ahead and flip the colour of our shoes. So I've now found them. Um, we're going to go ahead and put on the uh, smart shoes, okay? Now, it doesn't really matter if you use smart shoes or rubberized boots because that is the ones that we do use. Okay, So it's pretty straightforward. Um, make sure you do use rubberized boots because if you're using joggers, it will make the joggers not flip um, from joggers all tucked up to flat joggers, which are like cargo shorts, which are not really the best. Okay, So let's get on it. Let's get our shoes sorted. Smart shoes we're using, uh, the same, same color as we have on now because we want to keep the, the blue and I think it's blue and white ones have we got on so we found a component on her site we're going to scroll through the rubberized boots to keep them as joggers because we want to keep them and there we go also we've got the shoes on now another gloves we're going to keep black so it'll be the grey digital ones and with that being said that is pretty much complete okay so we've got a grey digital gloves on there we go pretty straightforward now okay we can save this now as console number two okay so this is what you should be outcomed with or console number one with the heavy vest on or merge slot with the armor and the jersey and this all right so now we're going to do the beth glitch with these two c1 and c2 and you will spawn in with this outfit or the outfit with um the uh, shorts on okay so it doesn't really matter now, this is what a lot of problems were coming recently again once you spawn in to that with that beth glitch you want to go into the crooked cop like last time this is what you should look like in the game flip it to color go once to the left once to the right the jersey should flip onto your outfit you should be all merged with the stickers CEO vest jersey joggers shoes gloves and then you are sorted to go pretty straightforward and really really easy to make this outfit guys um, if you have any questions at all please do let me know in the comment section below um, but yeah you should have no problem with this at all um, again the gloves merge is a bit weird uh, today, oh, well, it's been a lot weird recently. Um, so you might have to do that once or twice to actually flip the 
be able to flip it and put the joggers um, or the gloves onto your outfit by merging it in Crooked Cop. So don't get a bit angry at it if it doesn't work first time around. Uh, you will get out, you will get it at some point. Okay, it did take me like if it took me like twice to do it. First time I did that, I spawned him with no gloves, and I started to do it again. But anyway, guys, that was it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. If you did, please go ahead and drop a like, subscribe to the channel with those notifications on, and uh, yeah, till next time, it's your boy Dino. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, homies.